Hello viewers and welcome to our channel. We are a small group of creative, intellectually curious, open-minded individuals who are committed to challenging assumptions and evaluating data in a balanced and objective way. We are tech entrepreneurs, innovators, and quantitative analysts or quants who apply mathematical and statistical methods to financial and risk management problems. Over the years of working together, we have honed our ability to make accurate predictions and spot trends. Predicting the future is of course more of an art than a science, so we constantly aim to come up with better ways to optimize our forecasting capabilities. However, relying solely on forecasts from individual experts can be problematic for a few key reasons. Firstly, experts are susceptible to inherent biases that can skew their predictions. They may be incentivized by financial interests, swayed by groupthink within their field, or pressured to conform to mainstream narratives. Numerous studies have empirically proven that experts are only marginally better than random guessing when it comes to predicting future outcomes. Their accuracy rates are not much higher than if you simply flipped a coin. Clearly, expert opinions alone cannot therefore be fully trusted. Excitingly, technological advances are making prediction data more accessible than ever before, thereby reducing the need to rely on expert forecasters. In the past, only large corporations have been able to afford the resources needed to build advanced systems to analyze mountains of information and identify trends. Think of how BlackRock has been able to dominate finance with its proprietary software, Aladdin. Now, anyone can make better predictions by leveraging the wisdom of crowds via sites such as Polymarket, Manifold and Mediculus as well as artificial intelligence chatbots such as ChatGPT. But what we plan to do is save you the time and effort of data aggregation and curation by collating as much prediction data as possible from a diverse range of sources, then providing you with a digestible summary that can be easily consumed in an informative and entertaining format. That doesn't mean we won't ever share our own views on any particular subject, but we are smart enough to know that attempting to outperform the hive mind of collective intelligence is a fruitless exercise. One of the primary motivations for establishing the Bureau was to create a safe space where we could operate away from the influence of the mainstream. As outsiders, we have nothing to lose. This means we are far less likely to be affected by groupthink which often affects experts who work for academic institutions, corporate think tanks, and government bodies that want to control the narrative. For this reason, we are putting measures in place to ensure we become as cancel-resistant as possible so we can remain impartial. For example, we will ensure that we are financially supported by our community rather than third-party corporate sponsors so we can be free to express our views without being pressured by external forces. We will not back down from exploring subject matter that the mainstream herd is cognitively blind to or too afraid to tackle. The truth is that most experts are not willing to challenge the status quo because they do not want to upset their paymasters or risk being ridiculed by their peers. We believe that all new data should be assessed with equal weighting. Far too often data is dismissed by fact-checkers as fake news or conspiracy theory because it originated from outside sources that are not considered credible by the herd. By dismissing data because it doesn't match the herd's prescribed criteria, even if it turns out to be voracious, can lead to cognitive biases and missed opportunities. Of course, not all information touted by the mainstream as fake news is created equal. There's no doubt that nefarious forces are conducting misinformation campaigns, so precautions must be taken. However, even if fake news stories or conspiracy theories are ultimately false, they can still reveal beliefs and values of the people who believe them. This in itself can provide very valuable insights into the political temperature or general zeitgeist of a particular demographic or society at large. Furthermore, there are no ivory towers at Foresight Bureau. We want to appeal to a mainstream audience, so we'll actively avoid generating content that is difficult to digest. Although there's a plethora of material on the science of prediction and forecasting, it tends to be deeply academic, dry, and frankly boring. Of course, it is important to take a measured and diligent approach, but there is no reason why the process of prediction and forecasting can't be entertaining as well as informative. By providing you with a roundup of carefully curated predictions each week, we want to add an element of certainty in a highly uncertain world. Examples of topics that we plan to cover on a regular basis include the global economy, finance, cryptocurrency, and geopolitics. If, like us, you have been following recent developments you will probably share our frustration. There is no shortage of experts offering their assessment of the economy and global financial markets via mainstream media. This is something that affects the lives of billions of people around the world, but it appears there's very little consensus. Every day we hear from very well-qualified expert financiers, economists, and politicians about how the economy is going to either avoid a hard landing, fall into deep recession, or some other permutation of potential outcome. Each provides a highly compelling rationale, but the very fact that there is so little continuity of opinion guarantees that almost all of them will be wrong. Although we will cover the predictions of individual experts who we believe have something to offer, our main focus will be the aggregation of predictions from multiple sources. Furthermore, we want to encourage our community of supporters to fully participate in the process. 
We also want to raise awareness of prediction platforms in general and help drive adoption. The more traffic they obtain, the more valuable the outcome will be for everyone interested in making better predictions. In addition, by combining our collective intelligence we can level the playing field. The oligopoly of giant entities that have been able to use defensive moats to dominate the space can finally be challenged by the wisdom of crowds made up of people like you and me. We are also huge advocates of the shift towards decentralization. We believe that Web3 technologies that run on public blockchain protocols will make the entire process far more democratic, transparent, and efficient. That's because smart contracts have the potential to remove the need for centralized entities that currently act as subjective fact-checkers and truth guardians. Ultimately, we want to help our viewers, readers, and listeners obtain insights that will give them an unfair advantage when it comes to making better, more decisive and timely decisions. Click the subscribe button if you'd like to get access to all the most relevant, unbiased and entertaining predictions in a simple and easy format. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support our channel please head over to Substack and search Foresight Bureau and become a subscriber. Have a great day and we'll see you next time. Disclaimer, this video is intended for entertainment purposes only. We do not guarantee the accuracy or completeness of the information provided and we are not responsible for any losses or damages that may arise. Nothing should be interpreted as investment of financial advice.